strong. Hi everyone, it's Lisa from the Stony Creek School of Art. Today we're in my kitchen because we are going to be creating sidewalk chalk paint. So these are the materials that you're going to need. I'm going to use a muffin tray to put all of my colors in. I think it's kind of a neat idea because you don't have to carry around four or six different colored jars. Um, you're gonna need water, cornstarch, a mixing spoon, paint brushes for outside, and then you're gonna need your food coloring. So I just have four colors right here. And we are also going to need measuring spoons. I have mine here. I'm going to be using the tablespoon, which is this big guy. So I'm gonna open up my cornstarch. And I'm gonna start first by putting in cornstarch in each of the muffin tin sections. This is gonna allow me to have six colors. Perfect, so next we're gonna add water to each of these sections. I'm scooping it from a measuring cup only because I just didn't want my tap running and it being really loud in the background. But you can use water right from your tap. So now that I have all the water and the cornstarch in the containers, I'm gonna go ahead and start with my food coloring. So the more drops that you put in, the more vibrant the colors will be. Adding red and then blue, my favorite color. Now I've used up all of my colors in the four sections and I have two sections left. So this is when I can have some fun and mix some colors. So for this one right here, I'm going to be mixing yellow and red. And this one here, I'm going to do red and blue. So once you have that, next we get to start mixing. So at first, just go slowly. It's going to take a few seconds for the cornstarch to start dissolving. And then it becomes really liquidy. And that's what you want. So again, starting slowly. So see how thick it is at first? And then that cornstarch just dissolves. Next is red. This one that I did red and yellow, what color do you think this is going to turn into? Are you guessing? Did you guess right? Orange. Great job. And the last one, the red and the blue mixed together. Ooh, it looks really dark. But what is this going to be? Can you tell already? You were right again, purple. Awesome, so now we have all our colors. I can take my muffin tray outside with me with my paint brushes. I might take this with water so I can rinse my paintbrush to get different colors so they don't all mix. And I will see you guys outside. Okay, we're outside and now we get to have some fun. So 
you can paint with your color. Leave some nice messages for your neighbors. And just have fun. Thanks for joining me and we'll see you next time. Bye.